Hey, good morning, everyone. Happy Tuesday. Rob here for Southwest Florida Television. I am back for part two of my Tuesday morning beach walk at Del Menor Wiggins Pass State Park in beautiful North Naples, Florida. Earlier in part one, we were just watching some beautiful, beautiful colors in the clouds. Now that sun's getting ready to pop up over the trees and light up our beach, our beautiful beach and the water. The temperature's about, oh, 76. Still right in there, same as earlier. Water temperature anywhere from, oh, 81 to 83, 84, depending where you're at. Earlier this morning, this one cloud right here, oh my lord, just a bright orange, bright, bright orange. It was amazing. You got to go back and check out the first video. Hopefully Facebook saved it. I don't know. Never know with Facebook. Looks like a like a shoe print up there in the sky. Got a couple pictures of the clouds that I'll share with you later today. Just love this water right now. It's just like the temperature is just ideal. It's awesome. It is hard getting in and out of the water. It's hard getting out of the water. It's easy getting in, but there is a huge ridge up here in area four. Got to be really careful getting out. Pretty calm out here in the Gulf this morning. The tide is on its way in. Morning. Still coming in here. High tide up at Wiggins Pass is a little bit after 10 a.m. this morning, about 10.09. It's going to get warm today. Around 90, 91, somewhere in there. Couldn't get anybody to go to the beach with me last night for sunset and it started raining anyway around 6 30 ish maybe tonight you never know i love coming out here for sunset and sharing it with y'all good morning notice any sea turtle tracks on the beach this morning not even a false crawl I don't know what those girls are doing I don't know what those ladies are up to but we need some sea turtle nests on this beach 
I hope they're not boycotting Del No Ways. Hey, I did get to see a couple dolphins yesterday. Later in the morning, after I ended my live feed, when I was up talking to Jan and Jackie and Cindy, there was a couple dolphins playing out there in the water up in Area 4. They hung out there for a while. I was hoping they'd come so Jan and Jackie would get a dolphin fix. Now I'd like them to come and say good morning to us. <laughs> Whoop. There's the sun. Good morning. There is the sun shining through the trees. I'm standing right up next to the skybox at the north end of Area 3. And there it is. Getting ready to show itself here soon. This is paradise. I saw something out in the water. It was a pelican. A pelican splashing around. Well, next Sunday, I'll be down on the Naples Pier again, Sunday morning. That's a nice little change of scenery. I love hanging out there for sunrise. We kind of got gypped last Sunday. We didn't get any colors. It was a very weird sunrise last Sunday morning. The sky was just like a milky white. But... We made up for it the past two days, yesterday and this morning. Man, oh man, beautiful. Like I said, you gotta go back and watch live feed number one this morning. Beautiful colors. Oh, there's a horseshoe crab on the beach. I hope it's just a molted shell. 
Yeah, it's awful light. I think this is just an empty shell, exoskeleton. They shed everything. Those horseshoe crabs. It's pretty interesting to watch. There's some videos of them doing it online. It's the front end there. That's his eye there. Boop, boop. The little horseshoe crab, it's a little one. We've seen live ones crawling around here. We picked up some live ones and put them back in the water. Big ones too. Hey Mike, good morning. Thank you for the stars, my friend. Oop, Mr. Pelican. Zipping by. It's been two pelicans flying back and forth all morning. Well, where are you at, Mike? Are you on the road? Almost home. Awesome. Safe travels, my friends. Safe travels. Hey, if you're not a subscriber to my Southwest Florida Television Facebook page yet, please consider becoming one. That is, if you like my morning beach walks, if you enjoy our time together in the morning. The more subscribers I get, the happier I am. And the more likely to continue these live feeds in the morning. I sure do enjoy it. I enjoy coming out here and walking the beach and sharing my mornings with you. So think about becoming a subscriber. If you do that right now, until the end of this month, Facebook actually gives me a little bonus, a $20 bonus. So that definitely helps out. No matter what, thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for being a friend. Enjoy the views. Enjoy the walk. And hit that share button. Share, share, share. Forgot to look up in the pine tree here in area two to see if our osprey was sitting up there this morning. I didn't hear anything. It was quiet. Have a great day. The trees, the top of the trees starting to light up here. Do I see an osprey up there? Gorgeous blue now. Kind of a lighter blue, a powdery blue color up there. Mm. 
is our Osprey up there. Let's take a peek. I don't know. I don't see it. But. Huh. I can't zoom in. There we go. Is he up there this morning? Doesn't look like it. No Osprey up there this morning. Oh well. Probably out fishing. Out looking for breakfast. Beverly, good morning. Look at this cloud up here. Wow. It's interesting, interesting patterns. That's cool looking. Well, shall we turn around and walk up to Wiggins Pass and see what's going on there? Yesterday, T-Mobile let me down when we got up there. Dropped my signal, dropped my connection. Maybe we'll have better luck this morning. Maybe we'll see Kevin out here this morning. He's on duty. I forgot yesterday he had to go for some CPR training. Up towards Sarasota there, up at Mayaka State Park. He took some nice pictures that he shared on his Facebook page up there. Such an awesome, awesome park. You just never know what you're going to see here in the morning. 
This morning when I was out here, while it was still dark, I saw a night heron sitting out here on the beach. Beautiful birds, those little night herons. The Naples Zoo. If you've never been to the Naples Zoo, especially if you're a resident, you get those free Sundays to go to the zoo. All around where the alligators are is an aviary. It's a rookery for the birds. There's so many nesting birds in there. Egrets, tricolor herons, night herons. You got to You just kind of look close in the trees. It is amazing. There's places where you can see the nests with all the different colored eggs in them. And you see the babies when they hatch. It's really cool. I think this is the time. It's usually like spring. This is probably late. Some of those little hatchlings are pretty funny looking. They look like prehistoric creatures. <laughs> Those tricolor herons are wild looking the little chicks. Darn pelicans, I see them splashing out in the water, throwing me off. I'm getting all excited, I think it's a dolphin. Just our pelican friends. Back at the old skybox. No Gary, no sits in chair. Still no contact with him, no communication. I know he's alive though. There have been Gary sightings. I saw our friend Dexter the other day. He's doing good. He's walking pretty darn good now, and he's excited to get out on the beach. Very excited. He misses his morning walks big time.
Hey, if you're just tuning in, we're in North Naples, Florida. We're walking the beach at Del Nor Wiggins Pass State Park. We're walking north, heading up towards Wiggins Pass. It's beautiful out here. We had a beautiful, beautiful morning. The colors out here were spectacular. You get to see that if you watch part one of this morning's beach walk. And hit that share if you like what you see. Help spread the word. The more the merrier. It's very quiet today here at the park and on Facebook. of our little white ibis buddies. Hey Nancy, good morning. Pete and Nancy. Nancy and Pete. Darn flies are starting to come out. They get really bad for a couple weeks. Flies and the darn no see Welcome to Florida in the summertime. And mosquitoes. Besides your sunblock, you want to pack some bug spray when you go to the beach in the summertime.
I haven't heard that helicopter out spraying. I didn't hear it yesterday morning, and I haven't heard it yet this morning. Usually they're out just about every morning. Little sandpipers down here running around. Oh, off they go. They were camera shy this morning. Hey, Connie, good morning. Happy Tuesday. It was great seeing you yesterday. At the Naples House of Omelets, you, Rose, Jan, Jackie, Carol, June, Jennifer, Jamie. Who am I forgetting? Who else was there? There's about a dozen of us there. Me and, me and Jamie, we were outnumbered by the ladies. Oh, that's just terrible. <laughs> Those are the odds Roy likes. This is where the two dolphins were hanging out yesterday morning. Right out in here. They didn't come in real close to shore. They started to. We thought they were going to come up to shore, but they kind of, I don't know if you can see that little white buoy out there in the center of the screen there. The closest they got was about halfway between me and that buoy. where the signal pooped out yesterday up in here. Let's see if we have better luck this morning. Morning.
Oh, yesterday, yesterday, yesterday. There was an osprey in the nest here in Area Roy, the nest up here in Area 4. There was an osprey in that nest. Maybe, maybe they're going to come back and give it another try. So we're up in area five now. We'll go up and take a look at Wiggins Pass and then I'll start another live feed for my walk back down the beach. Pelican soaring by there. Well, thought he was going to take a dive. Thought he was going to take a plunge. It's fun watching those pelicans. We'll probably get to see them again this summer. Big flocks of them out here diving into the water. That is so cool. Just one of the incredible sights we've witnessed over the years. And the birds are on a feeding frenzy. Frenzy. Remember watching those of the fish literally just jumping up onto the beach? Man, that was some wild stuff. We would see that down on the beach down like in Pelican Bay down there between Vanderbilt Beach and Clam Pass. I'll go down there for another walk. I'm not going to walk to Clam Pass. <laughs> that's, in the, that's too far of a walk. That wore me out that morning. Fun. It's a fun walk, but it's a long walk. There's people that jog down there in the mornings. <laughs> Not this old boy. So there's a few more people popping on here. Good morning, happy Tuesday. Just about up to Wiggins Pass. I'm guessing the front gate's going to be opening soon here, if it hasn't already. Start seeing some more people here on the beach. Get all those little shells on the prayer tree.
well, here we are up at the north end of the park. Oh boy. <laughs> it's an obstacle course. Yeah, a lot different than it was. <laughs> it's, even yeah, it's really changing. Wiggins Pass, North Naples, Florida. fails. Well, I think I'm going to take a little break before walking back down the beach. We'll do that in video number three. Well, 
let's see what we did here this morning. Oh, got 200 stars this morning from Mike Arnold. Uh, that is it so far today. All right. I will be back if I don't see you later. Have a fantastic Tuesday. Thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for being a friend. Tell your friends about our morning beach walks. And invite them to join us. Southwest Florida Television. Bringing wonderful people just like you together. One beach walk at a time. You know the drill. <laughs>